uh, just doing a kind of whispered ramble, not too long uh, video here today, and to say I'm going to be doing an upcoming uh, Q&A video, so if you have questions for that, put it in this video, put your questions in this video, and then <clears throat> probably next weekend, Saturday or Sunday, I'll do it probably with gum chewing, uh, I'll do the answers to you guys' questions uh, next weekend, but I figured, you know, I'd ramble a little bit here, a little bit of a channel update, whatever, you know, um, I gotta do a butterscotch, eating butterscotch uh, word search, somebody wanted to see, um, uh, Lego Jurassic World, um, gameplay will go up next week probably as well, I'm gonna be mass peak on Monday, so I will probably do another shady kind of end to the other one video, kind of like a recap or whatever, I'll probably do that Monday, and then go in fresh with the other, uh, and then I'll go in fresh, uh, with some new shady tales, uh, you know, it'll be somewhat similar, but I want to kind of make them a little more, uh, organized or, you know, flow better or whatever, um, they were kind of all over the place last time, but, uh, uh, we'll see how I go about that, um, like I said, though, if you have questions for a question and answer video for next weekend, leave them, uh, in the comment section here, I haven't done one in a while, so, Figured why not, hopefully I get uh, a decent amount of questions, but, yeah. Um, went to some garage sales today, actually, I'm sorry, I only went to one garage sale today, it was really cool out this morning, it's like 5.50s. So we went to one garage sale, they had an Xbox uh, 360 and some controllers, but I had no interest. I had some games there too, but they were like the sport game. they were PS4 games. The sport games were like three bucks, and the, uh, like the other games, non-sport games, like 5 to 10, I was like, no, <laughs> um, yeah, so we have one of those one tomorrow I have to go to, so, uh, see if there's anything there, I don't know if there will be or not, but, um, we'll see how that goes, um, <laughs> Maybe, I mean, it was like six or seven hours, I can't really remember, because I'd played it, you know, back in July, and then finished it, you know, a few days ago. Then I started a new one up, because there's five people you use, and uh, if you play, you can play, like, co-op, and you can pass controller back and forth. At certain points, it will tell you, player two's turn, whatever. Um, and then I, I did that, I was going to play with my fiance, but she wasn't into it, so I just finished that myself. Um three of the five ended up dead. I don't even know how the one person died. They, like, fell, and there was no prompt or anything to save them or anything else, so I don't know if I did something earlier in the game that affected it. I don't know. Uh, the other two people bit it because I wasn't quick on the, uh, there's parts where you gotta stay calm. Uh, you're hit A for, like, to control your heartbeat or whatever, and, uh, you know, it gets fast in certain points, and, and I didn't make it. I actually had a choice between hiding and running, so next time I get to that, I'll do run. When you do beat the game, you can go to different parts of the thing, so you can do different choices immediately from certain, you don't have to play from the beginning. Um, so that's kind of cool, uh, but I just started a fresh one solo, so I'm doing it a little bit differently. I've made a few different choices that have already changed some things. Um, dogs barking outside. So we'll see, uh, you know, how I fare this time, because I was doing well. And then the one person just died, and I'm like, what the hell happened? I didn't even, I thought maybe, oh, they just fell, and they'll pop up again, they're unconscious, and they, they were dead. With not much fair for The next person, like I said, I got scared and fell, fell into a hole, onto a pipe. And then, uh, the third person, the same thing. I, I thought it was a quick X, X button press, but it was, they wanted you to jam on it, and I was too late. And a door was coming down on me and one of the bad guys. I didn't do it in time, so she got crushed. And the two people survived, uh, it's, what are their names, uh, Brad and Alex are brothers, Conrad and Julia are brother and sister, and then Fliss is, is the, the, the captain of the boat you're on, that you do stuff with, so, and you can build relationships. 
relationships and stuff between the people and stuff like that. And, uh, you know, because you got to, like, choose what you want to say or you can say nothing. You get three choices. You can find any clues to what happened on the big boat. You come in contact with this huge freighter. You start the game by using two soldiers. It's like 1947. You're on this freighter and then you find out, like, what happened to them when you're on it. And you find out, like, is it paranormal? Is it just some, you know? So the story was pretty cool. Um, the next one's called Little Hope. That comes out next month so I'm all, all about that I like this stuff these kind of games um, and that's it's only 30 bucks so pff, you kidding me like hell yeah um, I, there's supposed to be 7 I don't know if they'll get that far but uh, this is the second one um, yeah. and uh, we played Yoshi we played Yoshi again last night um, my throat's been bothering is really cool, but I'm not going to get to a lot of these games like Assassin's Creed Liberation. I'm just not going to get to. I'm not going to get to it. Um, I'd like to play it, but at this point, might as well just get rid of it. I haven't even installed uh, Earth Defense Force 2 on the VDI because it does a little quick installs. But it's not, I haven't even put it in the system, so I thought a lot of these games are starting to, which I thought, that's part of the reason I started getting them back when I did, I think it was like right after Christmas 2017, um, I had a gift card, like $30 GameStop gift card, and I bought, that's when I got Muramasa, uh, 
Dragon's Crown. And this other one I wasn't into. It was like a, a visual novel type game. I wasn't into it, so I sold it. But the three games cost me like, you know, five bucks you know, of my own money because I had a $30 gift card. I wanted Zero Time Dilemma, but they said they had it, but they didn't. This is when I was going to the GameStops, and they had, they had to give me a list because they didn't have them out, and they didn't even know what they had. They had them in drawers. Yeah, but I got those three games, sold the one. I picked up Uncharted, Earth Defense Force, Lego Harry Potter, um, Persona uh, 4 Dancing All Night, uh, Memories of Celsetta, um, Summon Night 6. I went nuts there for a little bit, and I got a couple from online as well, and then I calmed down. And then you guys hooked me up big time, so that was huge, obviously. And once again, completed beyond appreciative to that. Thank you. Because I want a nice collection, because I was like... I'm like, if I don't start getting them now, they're going to disappear at a store, so I'm going to have to get them online. And then, like, what's happening now, all these games are... Like, if I want Persona 4 Golden, all of a sudden I got to pay $50 for it use, I'm not doing it. for rent for like 
twenty dollars, which actually isn't that bad if you think of it. Because if two people, are go- if you're going two people to the movie theater, you're paying around twenty bucks, if not more. And it's going to be disappointing because you know when movies start to pick up again in you know six months, a year, whatever the hell it is. Those five dollars specials are going to probably be a thing of the past, like Seaford Theater, the Islip Theater, this theater is on the island that will do their their five dollar Tuesdays or whatever. Belmore and Merrick also do it. Um, those will probably be a thing of the past, which would be unfortunate. Uh, it's too bad. It really is, man. It really is. We'll see how it turns out. I think they'll come back. I think it's just going to take time, but whatever. Um, yeah. But yeah, it's just a kind of a, a little bit of a ramble here, uh, you know, and, and upcoming questions and answers. I just wanted, I didn't want to make like a two second video. Um, kind of wanted to get you guys another solid vid, solid timed video. I've been on such a roll, you know, I don't want to fill it with like all oh, a two, two second thing. I want it, I guess I could have did two videos, but whatever. No, I did do the I did the hour long rambles, but it's funny I did two hour long videos this month, which is pretty wild. Um, I'll probably do another beer drinking review this month as well. Uh, you know, probably I'll do the Jurassic World gameplay. Then I might do another gameplay of one of the games I got. I don't know. Maybe Man of Dan. Actually, if I'm gonna do a gameplay, a, a, a walk, a, like a playthrough, people have asked about this for a while. Man of Medan is actually the game I should do it with, or I'll do it with Little Hope when I get that. Or both, maybe, if you guys, you know, you guys like the sound of it. Actually, I didn't even think about that till now, because I would have already played through it, so I'm kind of going to know. That's why maybe Little Hope would be better, but it's not an overly long game, which is good. Um, i gotta, I got to figure out how to do that, though. I want to I wanna kind of... Uh, i got to free up space on my phone so I can go like a good 20 to 25 minutes on it. I usually can go about 15 if I really push it, but I gotta, I, I might just let the thing record one day and see how long it goes for before it turns off. Um, because I can do a, a, a walkthrough of, of that game, a playthrough of that game. Um, and it's pretty good with how it, you know, how it leaves off and stuff, checkpoint-wise or whatever. Um, yeah, I didn't even think about that until just now. And it's kind of cool because it's like an interactive movie of sorts. It has its issues in terms of like uh, some of the people didn't react well to the deaths of the, like their siblings and stuff. Um, the dialogue's actually really good. It flows fairly well. And it's got some like generic lines in it, but um, it, it's, it's actually pretty good. Um, it does hitch a little bit at points, kind of like stutter. I don't know if that's just an Xbox One thing or, or, or not. Um, it looks, it's a pretty good looking game for sure. Uh, the, all the people's, you know, faces look great. The guy from, uh, I think he played Iceman in uh, X-Men 2 and 3, Sean Asmore, is in it. Uh, he was also in Quantum Break, the game Quantum Break, so uh, he's making a name for himself on the video game scene. Uh, good, good. You know, it's it's a cool game. I like that kind of stuff. It's interactive. Like, I like the visual novel stuff of like an NG and Deathmark. Deathmark's a little more involved than NG, not by much. But I this one's actually kind of I like the way this works even better because you're controlling the character and stuff. It's a lot. It's mostly button pressing, but you're actually walking around and stuff like that. So uh, I like that a little. It's more involved. It's pretty creepy too. This is some good, good little out of nowhere things that work in it. So, oh yeah, and I want to put up another. Uh, maybe tomorrow, actually, I might put up another um, throwback video. I might do my survival horror collection. Man, I wish I had those games still. I actually still have one of them. <laughs> I think, or maybe two of them. But I think I have like ten survival horror games in that video. And you guys like the other one, so uh, you know I'll keep doing it. And like I said, I have longer gameplays on there for sure that I can put up. But, uh, yeah, I'll stop this here now, 20 minutes. Like I said, if you got questions, put them in this video. If you don't, you can comment as well, whatever you want to do. But if you have questions, put them in this video, and I will do that next week. Um, and, yeah, thanks, everybody, for checking this out. And have a good day, 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 day. I can do another Trigger Words video, actually, too.